Hello everybody, Jimmy is Promo here back again with another awesome video. And in today's video, I will show you how you're able to replace the tip on your S Pen for your Samsung Galaxy Note 8 as well as your Galaxy Note 9. Now, if you are brand new here at the channel of Jimmy's Promo and you own a Samsung Galaxy device, don't forget to hit on that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications so you get notified for future videos. And don't forget about that playlist tab on the very top to check out the entire playlist I've made so far for the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. So inside of your box, you do have a few important things other than just the cell phone and the wall charger. You do have some adapters. You also have your AKG headset, along with additional earpieces for different ear sizes if you need either small, medium, or large. And then the most important thing for the Note series is this tool. This is the tool that removes the tip of the S Pen along with these additional or replacement tips with two different colors. You have this white gray color or black, and each of them has their own specific purpose. So if you do see these two things in your box don't discard them don't throw them away and now you know exactly what they're used for now the original tip that comes out of the s pen with the galaxy note 9 out of the box is going to be this white grayish color now this one will basically simulate as if you're using a little pen or a pencil it's going to be a little bit more fine of a tip it's actually a little bit harder if you actually tap on the screen you will actually hear the tip hitting the screen itself so if you want it to have a little bit more fine of a tip something that simulates pretty much a pen or a pencil um, it's not going to be as smooth as the black tip then definitely use this white gray one but you will also notice that over time you might want to exchange this out because i can see mine is already getting a little dirty on the very end it might be not as fine or as new as when i first got this s pen out of the phone and that is one of the reasons why there is additional replacements now when it comes over to the additional color or the second color it's going to be this black tip now this one's a little bit more smooth this one i can see it working a little bit better with a film color color other than a tempered screen. So if you have a little plastic film on your screen, you might see that this black one will be a little bit better for you. It's a little bit more quiet and it feels a little bit more like a stylus. So if you want it to kind of be a little bit more smooth, then definitely go for the black tip. But if you want it to again simulate or feel like a pen or a pencil, then go with this white tip. Now I'm going to show you how you're able to easily pull it out and replace it with either of the different colors. Uh, so you'd be able to check out that process. So simply all you do is just take this little tool, you're gonna place it right into the very center of this little gripping tool. And as you basically grip it and you pull it out, it's gonna come out just like that. You place it down and you can either place in the black or white tip, depending on how you want it to feel. So I'm gonna place in the black tip so you can kind of see what that looks like. So if I move it over, it kind of blends in a little bit more. I guess there's not much white behind it. There we go. So this is what it will look like if you want your black tip to be installed on the S Pen, especially this yellow S Pen, which actually looks pretty cool if you wanted to have the black tip versus the white tip. So now let me show you that if I go inside of the Samsung Notes, they're both going to write the exact same. So the first one I will show you is with this black tip. So this is the one that I mentioned from before that'll be a little bit more smooth, feel a little bit more like a stylus, something that's a little bit more quiet. But one of the things is, let's say that I just wanna write down the word test. And then if I wanted to actually press down even harder, because of all the different pressure points, you can see that this one is more bold, it's a darker color, uh, and it's not really going to change no matter what the tip you do. So if you were trying to find a tip that's a little bit more fine, all you would really have to do is go inside of your little tool over here and make it go a little bit more fine than before. That's really the only way. There's a lot of pressure points inside the phone to pretty much pick everything up. Now here's the other thing. I'm going to try to actually tap on the screen and we'll see if my mic picks it up. So I did hit that pretty hard and now we're going to go over into this little white or grayish color and you're going to see that that little tapping is going to be much louder and everything else is going to look the exact same with how bold and thin all these letters are. So now again, you'll just take your tool, you're going to take it right on out, place in your white gray one. And I will let you know too, that if you do have the Note 8 uh, and you're using a, or you like to use the tips, maybe on your Note 9, these are actually the tips that came from the Galaxy Note 8. So these are the exact same ones for the Note 8 and for the Note 9. So you are able to keep some of these for future use. So now let's go over here. I'm just going to light pretty much write it pretty much kind of soft again. And then if I was to press it down hard, you can see that they look pretty much the exact same again. These ones are gonna be more bold, more darker of colors. If you do need to change again your thinness, you are able to just by doing it over there. Uh, but let's put this right back over here. Uh, I'm gonna pretty much erase this and then let's draw that in there. So you can tell that there's really no difference if you use the white or black in terms of how it looks on your screen, but there's a huge difference when it comes down to the sound. 
which you could probably hear that just a little bit louder, um, and also the feel of how it feels on the screen. So this right here does kind of simulate a little bit more of what a pencil or pen would feel like, uh, but when it comes over to that black one again, it's a little bit more smooth, a little bit more soft, a little bit more like a stylus. So now you guys know that everything inside of that box has a plan and a reason and a purpose. So definitely don't throw away this little tool. It'll definitely come in handy. Even if you hold on to these things for a couple different years, it'll work with all the different S pens that come out from Samsung. And also, especially these tips, these are definitely useful to hold on to and keep. Just so if you would like to make your S pen feel like brand new again, or if your tip happens to break, or if you want it to feel different. Again, I will reiterate the white one, the gray one right over here is going to be mostly for if you want it to be a little bit finer of a tip, a little bit harder of a tip, something that has a little bit of a resistance like a pen or a pencil. This one right over here, the black one is going to be mostly for a more smooth, more softer tip, even though they both feel pretty hard. It just somehow has a softer tip, making it feel a little bit more smooth, kind of like a stylus. So it depends on what feel you would like to use on your Galaxy Note 9 or the Galaxy Note 8. So outside of that, I hope that you guys have liked this video. Hopefully there's something that was brand new that you've learned in this video. If there was, make sure you guys give this thing a huge thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit on subscribe right over here. You can hit on that subscribe button on the very bottom left-hand side, that little red circle. Share this video with your friends and family and social media sites. And if you made it this far in the video, please write a comment of the color of tip that you are now going to replace and use or which color tip you, if you already knew these different things had a different purpose, let me know which tip you are using right now and which one's your favorite, the white or the black. And I'll see you guys later.